Sorry, it's DJ. Good morning, everyone. I am Teacher Connie, and I will be your teacher in Science 5. Before we start our lesson, I want you to prepare the following. Today, I will discuss why some materials are good conductors of heat and electricity. Have you noticed that nowadays, you can do things easily comfortably? Most places in the country have electricity, and because of this, you can just click the switch to make a dark place lighter. Study the picture. When you peel off the coating of an electrical wire, you will see the copper wires inside. Copper wire is the most widely used material for connecting electrical devices. Why do you think so? When you check your pots and pans in your kitchen, you will see that most of them are made of stainless steel or aluminum. Why are they suited for cooking utensils? Conductors are materials that allow electricity and heat to flow freely through them, allowing electricity and heat to be transferred from the source through them. Examples of good conductors of heat and electricity are as follows. Copper wires are widely used for electrical wiring because they are ductile and are good conductors of electricity. Aluminum is very good conductor of both electricity and heat. Most insulated power cables in supply systems are aluminum cables. Almost all get sinks for semiconductors are made of aluminum. Metals such as iron have metallic bonds. Because the electrons involved in the metallic band of iron are free moving. Iron is a good conductor. When their liquid or gas states, the electrons of ionic compounds are also able to move freely. One of the reasons why it is used in electronics is because of its electrical conductivity properties. Gold is highly conductive, meaning electricity can easily flow through it with minimal resistance. Silver is the best conductor of electricity because it contains a higher number of movable atoms. It means to say free electrons. For a material to be a good conductor, the electricity passed through it must be able to move the electrons. The more free electrons in a metal, the greater its conductivity. Copper is a reddish orange, soft and malleable metal that is good conductor of heat and electricity. Malleable it means low hardness. Most metals are pretty good conductors. However, apart from silver, copper is the best. It is used in many heating applications because it doesn't corrode and has a high melting point. The only other material that has similar resistance to corrosion is stainless steel. Water doesn't need to have a large amount of impurities to act as a good conductor of electricity. Even a small amount of ions can enable a source of water to conduct electric current. In a nutshell, water is able to conduct electricity due to the dissolved ions and impurities within it. Nickel It is a fairly good conductor of electricity and heat and is one of only four elements. The four elements, cobalt, iron, nickel, and gadolinium that are ferromagnetic at room temperature. When you say ferromagnetic, it means magnetized easily. Cooking fats and pans made of metals cook faster because they quickly allow heat transfer from the flame to the food being cooked. Coin, metal, spoons, and paper clip are also conductors. Metals are objects made of
check your answers. Number 1, I, 2, I, 3, C, 4, C, 5, I, 6, I, 7, C, 8, C, 9, C, and 10, I. For those who pass, congratulations! For those who fail, better luck next time! For activity 3, choose the letter of the correct answer as described in the statement. Write it on the blank before the number. Let us check your answers. 1. C 2. A 3. A 4. B 5. C 6. B 7. B 8. C 9. A 10. B If you got it right, excellent! What have you learned? Write in the blank the correct conductor of heat and electricity being discussed in the sentence. Choose your answers from the box.
Now let us check your work. Number one, silver. Two, nickel. Three, cooking pots and pans. Four, copper wire. Five, gold. Six, iron. Seven, stainless steel. Eight, copper. Nine, aluminum. Ten, water. If you got it right, high five grade five! I hope that you will always remember the things that you have learned today. Because learning is fun! Thank you for watching and listening. Bye!